So what do you think about the Verde Canyon train? It was a nice ride. It was uh, <clears throat> super comfortable, very quiet on the inside. Um, when you went outside on the observation cars, it was a little loud, but it's kind of to be expected. You know, there's no insulation out there, obviously. Um, but if you go out, I recommend if you go out on the outside, you know, for scenery and like that, that you um, get out there early so you can get um, a good spot along the rail. Uh, otherwise, you, you have um, blocked out a lot. Yeah, during the actual train ride, it was kind of noisy. So let's hope you enjoy the uh, photos and video that we took during our canyon train ride. It was a lot of fun and worth the money. But one thing I do recommend is um, eat prior to getting to the depot because the food at the depot isn't all that uh, spectacular. Um, you do get um, a little um, split bottle of champagne and um, a charcuterie uh, platter. Um, each person does, or each person gets a charcuterie and there's a split for two people. But the food at the depot um, the, that we had wasn't all that great. And I hate to say that, but Everything. Try not to pull any punches. And we try to save you money and have your best enjoyable time. And we're telling you what we experienced on our. Yeah, and it, you, it would save you like $34 if you either ate right before you got on the train, had a big, you know, had a big breakfast or an early lunch or something like that. Um, but, you know, the food at the depot was somewhat pricey, all about $17 and wasn't all that spectacular. Okay, well, in enjoy our footage. Thank you. This is traveling and luxury, but they didn't have this in the wild, wild west. 